Hi everyone, this is Space Toad and welcome to this new Buildcraft tutorial. Today we are going to see phased facade. So I'm going to assume that you know about facade already and I'm going to show you this new feature that was introduced in Buildcraft 6.0. That is the ability to have a facade that has two phased or, or two displays if you will. So in order to create a phased facade, I need a, an assembly uh, integration table, sorry. And the first thing I'm going to need to do is to place uh, the two phases in the integration table. So here, what I want is to have, uh, let's say, yellow as default. So I put uh, my uh, yellow whole facade on the left hand side, and then I want to have red if, um, for now, let's say, if something happens, so I put the red facade, the red wool facade on the right hand side. And while saying that, I'm realizing that I'm missing one piece of the puzzle, which in this case is red pipe wire. Anyway, carrying on. So this is not enough to create the face facade. I need to have, in addition to uh, this basic component, some redstone subsets and a pipe wire. Now, the pipe wire can be any of the four colors that are available uh, green, blue, red or yellow. Uh, and the one that I'm going to select is the one that is going to activate the phasing on the, face on the facade. So here, uh, let's decide that I want to activate the phasing on the red signal. So I'm taking the red pipe wire here and I'm placing it uh, as the input of the integration table. Now you can see that I've got this blinking facade uh, that just appeared here and as you can tell from the um, laser, sorry, uh, we are in process of crafting the, uh, the facade. So let's see, now I have one um, available already. Uh, let's just wait for a second one, and maybe we'll take others later. Alright, but for now, just two of them. So, in here, I have a, a small system of a pipe with a red pipe wire running on it, all connected with this gate, and as you can see on this gate, it's very simple, it says uh, if there is redstone signal, then send the red pipe signal. Indeed, if I activate this guy, I'm sending the signal. If I deactivate, I'm cancelling the signal. Now I'm going to place this facade uh, here. So for example, one here and one here. Now, as you can see, uh, there are the default color. And actually, since I'm in creative, I can um, add actually as many as I want. I can forget about that. Anyway, so now I've got a, a few facades that are placed on this pipe. Now if I activate the signal, which is here, the color red, I'm phasing out and I'm activating um, the second facade. I'm phasing them. If I deactivate the red signal, sorry, I'm going to go back to the initial state and back and forth. So. That's very neat uh, when you want to create a system that looks different depending on certain states. Uh, you could even create some hidden area. For example, here, this uh, looks like just uh, um, a few um, blocks, uh, a few bricks. But if I activate uh, the facade, the phasing here, uh, I'm displaying the contents. And you can see here that I've created phase facade that are this time reacting to the yellow pipe. Uh, in their default state, they look like bricks. And if I activate uh, this, I switch and I move on to uh, the glass display. So that's about it for this small tutorial. This was uh, a new feature in Buildcraft 6.0. If you have any question on this or any other topic, please feel free to ask those questions in the relevant sections on the Buildcraft forum. I will post the link uh, at the end of the video. Uh, but for now, thanks a lot for having watched this, for having studied uh, Buildcraft face facade. 
Uh, talk to you soon. Bye-bye.